Have you ever thought about what would happen if Africa split into two? How could it affect a country like India? Now this isn't a hypothetical scenario from a science fiction novel, it's an ongoing geological phenomenon that's gradually reshaping the African continent. Africa is literally splitting apart, driven by the activity of the East African Rift System. This massive tectonic shift isn't just a fascinating geological event, it also holds profound global implications. One country that stands to be uniquely affected is India. You might be wondering why India? What's the connection between Africa's split and this South Asian nation? Well the answers to these questions unravel a complex web of geographical proximity, historical ties, trade routes, geopolitical dynamics, and environmental impacts. So, are you intrigued? Great. Let's dive into the heart of this phenomenon and its implications for India. Africa is splitting apart, and the East African Rift System is the leading actor in this dramatic geological play. The continent of Africa is undergoing a colossal transformation, one that's been millions of years in the making. At the heart of this transformation is the East African Rift System, a complex series of rifts that stretch from the Afar region of Ethiopia all the way down to Mozambique. This vast geological feature is the birthplace of the Earth's tectonic activity that's gradually splitting the African continent into two. Let's delve a bit deeper. The East African Rift System is effectively a gigantic fracture in the Earth's crust. It's where the African tectonic plate is being pulled apart, a process known as rifting. The rifting process is slow occurring over millions of years. It's driven by the convective forces in the Earth's mantle, the layer beneath the crust, which caused the tectonic plate to stretch and thin until it eventually breaks apart. This splitting isn't happening evenly across the continent. Instead, it's concentrated along the East African Rift System. The eastern part of Africa, including much of Ethiopia, Kenya, and Tanzania, is slowly moving away from the rest of the continent. Over time, this movement will create a new ocean basin between the two landmasses, forever changing the shape of Africa. It's worth mentioning that this isn't a hypothetical scenario, the process is already underway. Evidence of the split can be seen in the form of dramatic landscapes such as the Great Rift Valley, a series of deep valleys and high mountains created by the rifting process. It's a living testament to the powerful forces at work beneath our feet. This massive geological event isn't just a fascinating spectacle for geologists to study, it has profound implications for the world at large, particularly for countries that are geographically close to Africa. As the African continent reshapes, the ripple effects extend far beyond its borders, reaching countries like India. As we move forward, we'll delve into the heart of these implications, particularly focusing on India's stakes in this grand geological play. Why should India bother about Africa's split? The answer lies in geography and history. India and Africa, though separate continents, are neighbors across the Indian Ocean. This geographical proximity has fostered centuries of interaction and exchange, from trade and culture to politics and diplomacy. In fact, historical ties between India and Africa are rich and complex, marked by shared colonial histories and post-colonial solidarity. Moreover, India has long-standing economic and strategic interests in Africa, underpinned by robust bilateral trade, investment ties, and a shared vision of development and prosperity. The splitting of Africa isn't just a seismic event on a distant continent, it's a phenomenon that could reshape India's neighborhood and impact its engagement with Africa. India's ties with Africa are deep and multifaceted. Any significant change in Africa's geography has substantial implications for India. As Africa splits, it's not just the land that changes. Maritime trade routes stand to be disrupted significantly. The shifting of the African landmass is predicted to alter coastlines, potentially rerouting sea lanes that have been in use for centuries. This becomes a matter of grave concern for India, given its heavy reliance on these maritime trade routes. The vast majority of India's trade with Africa, Europe and beyond is conducted via the sea, emphasizing the importance of these routes. The rerouting of sea lanes could introduce new challenges in navigation, potentially increasing travel times and fuel costs. Furthermore, these changes could affect the accessibility and security of crucial ports, adding another layer of complexity to India's maritime trade. As we delve deeper into this issue it becomes apparent how intertwined our world is, and how a seismic event on one continent can have far-reaching impacts on another. Changes in maritime trade routes could have serious repercussions for India's trade and economy. Shifts in the land can lead to shifts in power. Africa's split might alter geopolitical dynamics in the Indian Ocean region. 
The Indian Ocean, a vital artery of trade and communication, is no stranger to geopolitical tensions. With Africa's potential split, we might see a reshuffling of power equations in this region. India, with its strategic interest in the Indian Ocean, needs to be prepared for these changes. The country's ties with Africa are rooted in history and have evolved into a strategic partnership. Any alteration in Africa's geography could impact this relationship. Moreover, the split could lead to new nations emerging on the global stage. These potential nations might align with different power blocks, altering the balance of power. India would need to navigate these shifts and build relationships with these emerging entities. Adjusting to new geopolitical dynamics will be a critical challenge for India. The country will need to strategize and adapt to maintain its interests and influence in the region. Africa's split is not just a geological event. It has far-reaching environmental implications and calls for robust diplomatic engagement. This tectonic shift can alter the face of our planet, influencing ocean currents, climate patterns, and even biodiversity. For instance, the development of a new sea in the rift could change the flow of the Indian Ocean currents. This shift might cause changes in temperature and rainfall patterns, potentially affecting the monsoon-dependent agriculture in India. Meanwhile, alterations in marine ecosystems could impact India's fishing industry, which heavily relies on the Indian Ocean's bounty. Moreover, the creation of a new coastline may also lead to habitat loss for various species, some of which may be crucial for the ecological balance. India, as one of the world's 17 mega-diverse countries, is no stranger to the ripple effects that such losses can cause, making this a point of concern. On the brighter side though, this geological event might open up new avenues for scientific exploration and understanding of our planet. As we've seen time and again, every challenge is also an opportunity. Now, let's turn our attention to the diplomatic side of things. Africa's split isn't just a matter of science and environment, it's a geopolitical event that calls for strategic diplomatic engagement. As the world watches Africa's transformation, it's essential for India to nurture and strengthen its ties with African nations. India's historic and cultural ties with Africa, coupled with its commitment to South-South cooperation, position it well to navigate this change. By fostering dialogue and cooperation, India can work with African nations to address shared challenges, from climate change to maritime security. Moreover, diplomatic engagement can help India seize opportunities that might arise, be it in trade, investment, or scientific collaboration. In a world increasingly defined by change and uncertainty, such proactive diplomacy is more important than ever. After all, the continents may drift, but our shared challenges and opportunities remain. Understanding and addressing the implications of Africa's split is an urgent task for India. Africa's split is an unfolding phenomenon with global implications. For India, the stakes are high. We've journeyed through the geological processes that are causing Africa to split and how this seismic shift could potentially disrupt maritime trade routes vital to India. We've delved into how this shifting landscape could alter geopolitical dynamics in the Indian Ocean region, creating potential challenges to India's strategic interests. We've also looked at how this significant event could impact India's economy, environmental conditions, and security considerations. The importance of diplomatic engagement with African nations in this context cannot be overstated. In the face of such monumental change, India must remain vigilant and adaptive. It's a complex, evolving situation but one thing is clear. India cannot afford to ignore Africa's split. 